Hey everybody, this is Jerichos, and welcome back to Sea of Stars. Last time, we managed to help Basit achieve his dreams of proving himself in the Colosseum. And as a result, we got... Uh, oop, wrong button. Uh, we got a new crew member, Crystalian, who is having the time of his life. Speaking of crew members, though, we still have two more side quests. Gotta find the last of those Solstice Shrines, and... Hortense wanted help with setting uh, the Necromancer's guys, uh, like her butler, put his mind at peace. I, I don't know. It's complicated, but I realized that if I'm going to search for the Solstice Shrine, maybe I should start checking back uh, islands we've been before. And, I mean, what better place to start than Wraith Island? Because, I mean, we haven't been here since we started to have flying ability. That's a solstice shrine, isn't it? It is! Okay, I think this might be the fifth one. Oh! That's why we couldn't do anything here. We came here before we had the grapple. Well... Let's see what awaits us inside this door. Another neat puzzle of some type. Wonder what nifty uh, power we're gonna, or not power, uh, item we're gonna get here. Hmm, okay. Oh, these like, they're weights. Um. See, can't can I do something with what is this? It's probably whatever those floating things are. I gotta stick those in the wall. All right, does it slowly raise back up? Mm. I just gotta be quick, don't I? No. Hmm. Well, let's try putting this here. Solstice Shrine Key A. Well, that works. Shimmering Staff? Is that... Not improved. So I guess we could have come in here much sooner and, you know, gotten that. Uh, let's see, can I... Ooh, can't get over there fast. Uh, let's go up here and try the middle one, too. All right, can we, oh no, can't do that. Does this reset? Hmm. Okay, what's the trick with this? Can I actually take this out of here? Oh, I can. Hmm. In which case, now I put it in here. Aha! That's the trick. Oh, nope. I gotta let it go all the way down. Neat. And we get another one. Whee! Alright, put this in here. Release this. Grab our other key. I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it. And what does having these two? Aha! Okay. So now I don't need this one. And this should complete the puzzle. Oh, wait. Whoops. I jumped a step. Aha! That's where I need to put that to get those little platforms out. 
All right, lock in place. And now I think we're good to jump up here. I'll bet you that's a weapon for Zale. Yep, shimmering sword. <laughs> Both excellent weapons against undead. That would have been amazing when we were first here. But as it stands, a solstice sash. Wonder what that does. You know, I feel like I saw this place. I feel like it was like early on in the adventure, or maybe I'm just projecting. We'll find it though. Uh, solstice sash, magic attack plus seven. Hmm. Ooh, tempting. You don't need quite so much HP. Oh, but you can't use it. It's only for us. Well, oh well. We've managed to take care of all of this. Uh, wrong direction pointing. But we got to find where that mystery wall was where all the lights were hmm I'll come back here and deal with you later I don't know why do I feel like was it somewhere back on our starting island um now this is just up here I'm going to explore the mountain trail because I feel like there was something here. Well, let's journey through it. It's funny, I don't need to stand on these platforms, but I kind of do just out of habit. Oh, yes. The Elder Mist. Uh, where does this take? Those you guys go to the Elder Mist Trials. No, we don't need to go to the Trials. Um, it's down here. Was this climbing? It's up to the right. Oh, ingredients. Oh, I want to grab it. There we go. Loving this music. Actually, kind of wondering if I get in a fight with somebody here. Oh, yeah. Let's... Let's see how quickly I can destroy this thing. Um, 56 HP? How much HP does he sell? Three. Ah, that was easy. There's... Ooh, wait, what is that up there? This was it! Okay. Um, I have no idea what we're going to find on the other side of this, so let's go through. Solon and Luana, you have come a long way on this journey. Weapons of great power have manifested in the dream world. Prove yourselves worthy and claim them as your own. Okay. Let's do it. This challenge is for the two of you alone. Are you ready to face me one last time? Oh, face him again? Okay, uh, hang on. Let's see. Combo points build faster. Party max HP was 20. Um. Ooh, Reaper's Mercy is tempting. Um. Yeah, instead of. Ooh. I don't think it's likely it's going to do a killing blow when we're above 20% HP. I'm going to stick with what we've got. And these are good. Yeah. All right. We're ready to face the Elder Mist again. Then close your eyes. Is this just a boss fight or is this a whole nother... Oh, it's just a remix boss fight. All right. Um... Let's 
Moonerang. Yeah. Show him what we got. Oh, oh, he's going to counter. Okay, um, I forgot. I think I remember fighting him last time that his sword, we absolutely... Yeah. Okay. Um, I don't think I want to break that attack. I think I want to keep attacking the sword. So... Torblado. Oh, dear. Ow! Oh, ooh, that hurt. Zale, you definitely need a boost in healing light here. And I think I'm gonna get my combo meter up, and I'm gonna save the combo for healing lights. Or not healing lights, um, mending light. Ooh, could I block that? Oh, that's, that's sorely tempting, but... Hmm. Nope. Heal, and then attack the weapon. Alright. Good, we blocked it. Okay. Oh, nope, not gonna combo it, gonna keep working on this. Cause he's gonna counter everything I hit his way. Alright. Um Yeah, just keep up the damage on that thing. Um Actually, let's toss a lunar shield out. You got the MP. Also, it's nice the light bit of healing it does. Oh dear. Ouch! That hurt. Um. Heal yourself, Zale. Alright, what's this attack? Ooh, glad I healed. Seriously, you are just being mean, dude. I know this is, like, an ultimate trial, but come on. Alright, um... Did we... Oh, we did it. Okay. Good, because now that that's happened, I'm going to absolutely moonerang him and break this attack. That was good damage. Alright, we got pretty much full combo meter. Uh, I'm gonna save the combo though and do some physical attacking here. Alright, oh shoot. No, we can do this. So if I do a boost attack for each of you. The sword is feeling better. Oh, great. Um, he's gonna counter this, but let's let's do a sunball to break the attack. Okay, he didn't counter that. That's good. You know what? I'm going to test this. If I just break it instantly, is he going to counter? Yes, he does. Shoot. Alright. Um, no, I don't need a boost. Let's just do a Mending Light. Hey, we got an ultimate built up. It's going to do some good damage. Uh, 
I'm gonna target the sword and use this. I hope this doesn't result in a counter, but let's find out. I mean, we might as well do some really good damage here. We've got the ultimate. And blast him. <laughs> good damage. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, and the sword's broken. Okay, wonderful. Let's hit him a few more times. I think what I'm going to do is try to keep at least two of those ready. Um, oh, tempting. Um, nope, not going to use my combo. I'm saving it for Mending Lights. That is okay. Uh, oh. Hmm. Let's boost a Moonerang, just to do some good damage. I do like that he's at least weak to our magic. Alright, Torbledo, sure. Ow. Alright, you've got full MP again. Let's do a boost and heal. It's nice that the weapon doesn't have that much HP. It's got less than 500, so we just keep this up. And we'll have it back down in no time. Mmm tempting as it is to go for breaking those locks. I think instead we need to focus on breaking the weapon. Alright, this is gonna hurt. This is a big one. Ow. Um... No, she, she will definitely counter that. Um, let's boost a Mending Light. Heal up. I think he's doing a heal, but... Yeah. Okay, he healed himself rather than the weapon, at least. Hmm... Can I destroy the weapon with this turn? I did, good. All right, what's this attack gonna be? A thunder, not bad. Okay. That's all right. Oh, yes. Uh, I don't need to boost this. Such good damage. I love doing that. Uh, Zale, you got pretty strong sunball attack. Let's let's do that. Sword is feeling better. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, Crescent Arc will hit both, won't it? Yeah. Let's just smack it with some boosted attacks. Yeah, boost it. You know what? You got the MP. Let's Lunar Shield and just protect against one of those slams. Alright. Um, I think that I'm okay to just 
attack this a few times and let this attack go off. Good. Now, Torbledo, who are you attacking? I'll break this attack and then probably heal up. Yeah, let's Mending Light. Ooh, and now it's time for another ultimate attack. Although, I think I'll wait until the sword's feeling better because it'll one-shot the sword. Okay, sword's feeling better. Haha, <laughs> didn't hurt. Mmm. Well, as much as I'd like to, um, well, no, I want to use Zale's ultimate, but I'd rather one-shot the sword. Ooh. No, you don't get any heal off. It's worth taking a hit of counterattack damage. Now Zale gets to do his ultimate. It is fun uh, fighting this guy again. It's a similar mechanics to before, but we've got so much more uh, attacks at our disposal, so I guess they can do more interesting things with it. Did we destroy the sword? Oh, we didn't destroy the sword. It wasn't quite enough. Um, let's... Let's do this. The sword is absolutely on the brink, so let's go ahead and Moonerang. There we go. I feel like I've gotten good at uh, Moonaranging the. Uh, like getting a bunch of combos going. Yeah, Sunball, break that last one. He's got to be close to defeated. Oh, our combo is at max. I should absolutely... Well, we're going to Moonerang, then I'm going to heal up. All right, Mending Light. Otherwise, we're just wasting combo meter buildup. Yeah, yeah, sword's back. Go ahead, punch us. That's fine. You know what? Lunar Shield. Keep building this up. More and more for that ultimate gauge. You know, it's funny, I realized all of their skills that attack are a like AoE in some way. Um so there's no real point if I want to avoid ooh counterattack. Um, yeah, it's okay. He's gonna do a Torbledo. That looked painful. Let's boost the healing light just so you don't die. Yeah, yeah. Heal yourself, sure. I'm just gonna keep up the damage. I... Cannot. Can't risk it. Don't want to get a counterattack right now. Oh! Well, that worked. I could have done it. Now, sure, let's stop this from going off. Um. Let's. Ooh. Yeah. We got the combo. We don't need the heal. Let's do a Soonerang. Do some good damage to this guy.
Elder Dist. Defeat the Elder Mist for the second time. Love that we beat him with a Soonrang, too. Woo, woo, woo. Strong you are indeed. May these serve you well. Sunblade. Moonbow. Godspeed, Solon and Luana. We did it. Let's check out our new weapons. The legendary sword of the guardian god Solon. The legendary staff of the guardian goddess Luana. Oh, that's nice. Look at our stats there. Some good attack power now. So we've gotten the ultimate weapons for Zael and Valir. Gotten an ultimate armor for Basit. Ultimate weapon for Rashan and for Sarai. Oh man, we're doing so good. Alright, next time we're going to go help out Hortense with the Necromancer's butler. If you've enjoyed this episode, make sure to click like and hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys next time.